So if you're an experienced reseller, you already know the answer to this. But if you're just learning and looking for something to sell, what if I told you that you can go to thrift stores and buy used hats and sell them online for profit? Would you believe me? Well, the answer is yes. And in this video, I'm going to show you 10 hats that I recently sold on eBay that I found in thrift stores and sold for profit. Hi, welcome to the video guys. My name is Steve and I'm a reseller on eBay and Poshmark. Today's video I'm going to show you 10 hats that I found at local thrift stores that were mostly used, bought them at a very minimal price, and resold them online for profit. I'm going to put them on the screen, tell you where I got them, what I paid for them, how long they took to sell, what they sold for, and my approximate net profit. If you're not sure because there's a wide range of hats, off the top of my head, I can say the top three things are sports, destinations, and branding. All right, first hat up is a Ski of the Summit. This is a vintage red corduroy hat. Corduroy hats have become very popular. You know, obviously they're vintage. This one was a nicely embroidered. Just had some people skiing on it. Didn't really have a location name. Just Ski of the Summit. Picked this up at the Goodwill Bins for 50 cents. Sold in three weeks. For $24.75 plus $4 shipping, and I netted roughly $20. Next hat up is a DC Comics Aquaman logo hat. I had picked up four of these. They were all brand new at a local thrift store. I paid $1 each. This is the last one that I had left. It took about 10 months to sell. Sold for $14.36, which seems like a weird number, but I had a sale on my store. And plus $4 shipping, and netted roughly $11. Now here's a great hat when it comes to branding. Ferrari. Okay, that's a very strong, popular brand. Paid 50 cents for this at the Goodwill Bins. Sold in about two weeks. $18.75 plus $4 shipping, and netted roughly $15. And I charge $4 shipping on all my hats, and I put them all in boxes. I put them into a clear suffocation poly bag, for protection and into an eBay 8x6x4 box. Typically most hats are going to weigh in with the box right around 7 or 8 ounces so it's very affordable to ship. Okay here we have a hat and this would be a destination. SeaWorld, it's a SeaWorld rescue hat. Picked this up at the bins for 50 cents. Sold in one month for $12.75 plus $4 shipping and netted about $10. Okay, here's something you should always look for, a Masters Golf. I found this at the Google Bins for 50 cents. It still had the tag on it, and it was a 2006 hat. Sold in 10 days for $20 on Poshmark, and netted roughly $15. All right, here is a vintage hat. Vintage hat have become very popular, so always look for those as well. This was a Nissan, was the brand and it was the Luxor Hotel in Las Vegas. I found two of these in excellent condition at the Goodwill Bins. Paid about 50 cents each. Sold in one month for $17.75 plus $4 shipping and netted about $14. All right, now here's a sports team. Miami Heat, it's an NBA basketball team. Paid 50 cents for this at the Goodwill Bins. Took about eight months to sell. Sold for $18.75 plus $4 shipping, and netted roughly $15. All right, now here's something, if you didn't know better, you would pass on it. Fast food, hats, clothing, they sell. For whatever reason, a lot of companies, the employees have to actually buy. And I've heard that's the case with Chick-fil-A. They get like one free uniform, then they have to buy the rest. So if you say Chick-fil-A clothing, shirts, pants, or hats, pick them up because they're going to sell. So this was a brand new Chick-fil-A hat I found at the Google Bins, so it cost about 50 cents. Sold in two days for $16.75 plus $4 shipping and netted roughly $13. All right, here was a San Antonio Stock and Rodeo Show hat that I found at the Google Bins. It was brand new, mint condition, 50 cents by weight. Sold in one week for $13.75 plus $4 shipping, and netted roughly $11. And lastly, this was a Yasu, I believe is how you say it. I found this at the Google Bins for 50 cents. It was brand new. I did not know what that 
brand was. I had never heard of it. But when I looked it up before I bought it, had some comps. Turned out to be some sort of like electronics company, I believe. I don't remember. Um, sold in two weeks for $12.75 plus $4 shipping. And then roughly $10. All right, so out of these 10 hats, my total buy cost was $6. Out of the 10 hats, after paying fees and recouping my $6 buy cost, I netted approximately $150. Two sold in under a week. Four sold between a week and a month. And four took longer than a month. So hatching out big money, you know, you will come across one or two here or there that sell for decent money. But if you can turn 50 cents or a dollar into 10 or 12 dollars, you know, it definitely adds up. So I appreciate you watching. If you have any questions, put them down below. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.